Hello Supreaser, so today we're going to learn how to create an OZIA staff in Finale. Now let's say we want uh, to create an alternate version of these two measures. Well it's quite simple. Step one is we're actually going to create a new system. And so we're going to come up here, add another clarinet B flat part, and then we're going to input the notes that we want as alternate notes. Let's say it's those notes, I'm just putting in random notes for now. Next we're actually going to go to their staff tool, select this staff, and make sure we have allow hiding when empty selected. That allows us for when we actually select the staff and then come up here, hide empty staves. It allows us to hide all the parts that are not actually shown or have anything on them. Then we're going to come back to our staff tool because we want to get rid of all these empty measures. We're going to highlight the empty measures, go staff, apply staff styles to score and parts, and we're going to do force hide staff cut away. Now alternatively, um, we could use a keyboard shortcut for this. And if you want to know any of the keyboard shortcuts for this, just look at whatever is in the parentheses. So we can see we have H there in the parentheses. So we're going to apply for now and then use the keyboard shortcut on this side and just hit H and they're hidden. And so now we can see we actually have an alternative part right here. But normally uh, OCS are slightly smaller. So we're going to go over to our, our resize tool. We don't want to resize the note. We want to resize the staff. And we're going to resize it to 80%. And there you have it an OZIA part in Finale uh, using all built-in features in Finale. So if you found this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe so that you can stay up to date with all the Finale tricks.